All right, y'all, it's Water God TV, man. We back with another video. Y'all know how we do, man. Health, wealth, and a better understanding of self. So, guys, make sure y'all like, subscribe, and comment on the channel, okay? Even share, because that's the best way that y'all can help me get these videos out. And I need all the help I can get, okay? So do me a solid. Now, listen, I'm going over Fannie Willis, right? Fannie Willis, she turns the table on her accusers. She does it again. Fail, it never fails. Every time she get caught in the wrong, she always got uh, something to say, you know, to try to get out of it, all right? So Fanny once said, though, if it is any improper relationships that, you know, you should be terminated. And I'm going to let y'all hear it out of her mouth. Check this out. It is saddening to me if young women felt like they came to work and they were, one, even judged for being a woman, but two, if certainly they felt uncomfortable within the workplace. Mm -hmm. um, that will not be something that is allowed on my watch. Um, supervisors under my leadership that are not encouraging and building up my staff will not be supervisors long in my administration. And um, I certainly will not be choosing people to date that work under me. Let, let me just say that. Um, you know, we are at a place in society where things happen in people's relationships, husband and wife, sometimes there are outside relationships. I don't think that that's what the community is concerned about, although there, you know, there might be a, a moral breaking in that. I think that what citizens are really, really concerned about is if you chose to have inappropriate contact with employees. I mean, there's nothing that I can say on it other than it is distracting. Um, it is certainly inappropriate for the number one law enforcement officer in this state. Um, and it just, it, it really, really saddens me. And it will be very unfortunate if the taxpayers of this community have to pay for any of those laws. Okay, so listen, y'all just heard what she said, right? Now she admitted, Fannie Willis admitted to the the relationship right but now she goes on to say that make sure you get your free water test at environly.com here we got mr pollock he had a cornfield he took advantage of a free water test from us and this is what we found in this water we found sulfur we found hardness and we solved this problems with an easy fix of two tanks so get your free water test today stay blessed click the link below um, it's worth nothing that there are at least two personal relationships among the collection of defense attorneys representing the defendants that, under the standard urged by Mr. Roman's motion, would almost certainly require disqualification. Hmm. So she said Amanda Clark Palmer, counsel representing defendant Ray Smith, and Scott Grubman represented defendant Kenneth cheeseboro are publicly known to be in a personal relationship since the defendant cheeseboro uh cheeseboro has pled guilty and agreed to testify for the state in the upcoming trial against defendant smith and the other remaining defendants one who was ill-informed about the standard for attorney disqualification in georgia might argue that the personal relationship between clark palmer and grubman could all could rise to the level of a conflict given potential testimony by Grubman's client, Clark Palmer's client. Okay, so now <laughs> this is what she's doing. So basically, she's basically trying to say, Hey, look, point the finger. All right, now I don't care about really that she's messing with Wade, it's more about the money to me. Okay. It's really about the money, okay? It is, uh, you know, but you said it out of your own mouth that, you know, it ain't right that, the, you know, people would feel uncomfortable with knowing that you got a relationship and there's money being transpired. It's just going to make people feel uncomfortable. But you let Wade bill you 32 hours in one day, okay? You paying him an exorbitant amount of money, okay? You accent uh congress for five more million dollars we just looking at the money at this point we don't care like i'm past the relationship stuff i'm just talking about the money and y'all gotta check um uh, y'all gotta check out my channel where i did a video um on 
and I showed you how she did the manipulation to get into a district attorney. So I did a video on how Fanny stole her boss's job, okay? The manipulation that she did with uh, Paul Howard. I also did a video showing how Fanny and is funded by George Soros. Y'all check this out, man. There's some great information to let you know how snaky this woman is, man. How she's getting to this spot and she's she's a beast, man. She is definitely trying to uh, manipulate and whatever she got going on. I could see right through it, but it ain't working with me. I'm trying to chase the money. So the money that you're doing is really what is bothering people. You got taxpayers coming up to the podium, speaking to the Congress, talking about they don't trust you with the money. Stop just bringing up the relationship. The taxpayers in your county is talking about this. So it's like, I'm tired of these. This is why we need the independent radio. And I want y'all to push me through the algorithm, share, comment, like, because if we don't have independent media to be able to uh, express the real, what people are thinking, they will try to just manipulate the news so they gonna think we stupid or something it's like we don't we're not worrying about the relationship yes you had a relationship with them we worrying about the money we talking about the five million dollars that you asking for and the billing how you're billing this man he's getting seven hundred thousand dollars a year okay so that's what the concern is we ain't worried about trump we're not with all of that we're trying to say it's people that's coming up to your podium of taxpayers that's saying listen hold yourself accountable all you got to do is say yes guys i made a mistake this was wrong it's like people don't even want to be accountable no more that's why i have no sympathy for her because she could have just set up and said look i was wrong you went up to the church said all of this and just sounded so phony it didn't even sound you reading off of something you couldn't even speak to us face to face out to the screen you basically reading off of something and, and and you know it sounds it didn't sound like you genuinely cared about what you were saying so hey that's what i think about this man it was out of her words that she gonna have to terminate people that have improper relationships she said this so let me know what y'all think in the comment section, man. She gonna have to speak on the 15th. It's gonna be big, okay? Yeah, she need to just step down. You making yourself, your community, people look bad who voted for you. The people who put you in office, you making them look bad. Speak about the money. Stop speaking about the relationship. Speak about that 32 hours you build them in one day. What job do you know where you can go at and, and, and you can let them bill you for 32 hours in a 24-hour workday? Let me know where that can happen at. Hey, but I'll catch y'all in the next video, man. Peace and love. Don't forget to click the link for the water. Change your water, change your life.